Hey, what is up guys? Jeremy here and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak iOS 8 on the Mac. Now the way that you're going to do this is you're going to need uh, obviously a, a way of using Windows to actually jailbreak it because the uh, jailbreak only supports uh, Windows at this time. So the way that you're going to want to do that is with a virtual, mach uh, virtual machine and as you guys can see I actually am using uh, Parallels and I'm running Windows 8.1 through that. Uh, there's different ways of doing this. Um, I actually have the full paid legit everything. I uh, have you know the paid parallels, which is like 80 bucks, and then I also do have you know a legit paid version of Windows, and it ends up being a little over $200, just so you guys know. But uh, there is ways of downloading it and hacking it for free that I will not be showing. So, like I said, you're gonna need uh, a virtual machine running Windows. And what you're going to want to do is obviously open up the virtual machine. As you guys can see here, we have it running. And you're going to want to download the uh, Pangu jailbreak uh, version 1.0.1 is the latest version that's out right now. The link will be down in the description for that. Uh, and also, just remember, you're going to need to use whatever uh, browser, internet browser, you have on your virtual machine and download it You know, through the virtual machine. As you guys can see, I do have the Pangu app right here so do keep that in mind and then I also do have iTunes installed uh, just to make sure that it detects my device and it pops up uh, that way I know that you know this virtual machine recognizes that there's a device so now we're gonna go ahead and hop over to our iPhone I'll be using my iPhone 5s in this video as you guys can see and the first thing you guys are gonna want to do on your device is make sure that you turn off the passcode lock so make sure that it's turned off and also touch ID and also make sure find my iPhone is turned off Make sure all of that is turned off, and um, basically it's going to be turned off the entire you know the the entire time you're jailbroken for now until there's an update for it because uh, if you turn your passcode on and you reboot your device you will go into a reboot loop. Um, as far that, that that's, that's as much information I've gotten on it, so uh, just you just keep in mind you're always going to have to leave those off. So once you have those turned off, go ahead and plug your device into your computer. Uh, via lightning cable USB and uh, as you guys can see iTunes automatically opened up on my uh, virtual machine simply because I have my machine um, you know detecting my devices parallels allows you to choose you know uh, usually when you plug it in whether to use the Mac or the or the Windows so obviously pick Windows so that it recognizes and then also as you guys seen iTunes opened up so it does know that it's there so we can go ahead and open up the Pangu jailbreak and as you guys will see it'll take it a second but it will recognize my device uh, you just got to give it a minute there you go there's my iPhone iPhone 5s uh, and obviously I'm running the latest iOS 8.1 so the next thing you guys got to do is just make sure this little box is unchecked right here because it'll uh, download and install uh, some extra stuff onto your device that you do not want all we want to do is jailbreak so uh, once you're done with that you can go ahead and click on this blue button and it will be begin the jailbreak process do not touch your device or uh, the jailbreak utility or anything at all until this this bar is completely done and it goes back to the way that it looked when you initially opened it up when it did not detect your device so do not touch anything and I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward this for you guys all right the jailbreak process is done so I'm gonna go go ahead and slide the setup I'm gonna cut this part out because I don't, don't want you guys seeing my iTunes uh, information so Alrighty, and that's all we got to do if we swipe over to the right. As you guys can see, there is the Pangu Jailbreak application. Uh, it's as simple as that. Now stay tuned in because I will show you how to install Cydia uh, using Windows and WinSCP since I've had a lot of people ask me to do like the Windows version of it uh, since yesterday I uploaded uh, how to do it on the Mac with Cyberduck. A lot of people want to see the exact process with WinSCP on the, on Windows. So stay tuned in for that. I'll be uploading that shortly. And again, this is how you're going to jailbreak uh, your iOS 8 to 8.1 device on a Mac. Again, you need a virtual machine that runs Windows, and you just do it exactly as, as I showed it. Uh, if you got confused at all during this tutorial, I have a written guide on everythingidevice.com, which also does have the links to... Uh, what I am using exactly in this video, which would be Parallels and uh, Windows um, Windows 8.1. And like I said, it, it's about a $200 investment. Uh, the Parallels is about uh, 80 bucks plus tax. And then 
Windows 8 is about 126 bucks or something like that after tax, I believe. So uh, again, like I said, I'll leave uh, everything on the post and the link is down in the description. Uh, so if you guys enjoyed this tutorial, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out tremendously. Also, if you guys want to see more iOS 8 jailbreak coverage, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Later!